Hello again, human beings from the planet Earth. We're looking at a post on Facebook from uh, one of my connections, Rich Fu, who I don't know personally, but uh, have seen uh, very active online to share information, wake people up. And uh, it seems that um, these people here, Car Arms, I'll show you their website quickly, uh, has really uh, treated him not only uh, unjustly but just disgustingly and foul. Uh, I want to read this to you and then I'm going to ask you to support Rich uh, as he fights to to get uh, compensation um, that he seemingly deserves. Uh, here it says, I started work for car as a person disabled from a set of car accident, not my own fault. I broke my back and shattered my kneecap. I was hired upon the written understanding I needed an ergonomic chair and my doctor appointments. This was extreme right-wing company and they never provided me with the chair. In fact, they played games with it, even tampering with my chair to cause it to fall to the ground. I had to endure sitting on a chair with no spring for months. This resulted in my back getting very bad and I started to miss more time uh, due to doctor appointments and I, I was written up for it. I complained many times along with the way of people calling me gimpy people playing games with my health, understand doing uh, that to my chair could literally paralyze me, hid my cane when I needed it, and all for a laugh. I was reprimanded for making the complaints. I was told I was being sensitive and running, uh, ruining their laughter. My body went far downhill to the point my spasms were literally dislocating vertebrae, an extremely painful thing that literally would make me tear up just to try to type. I wasn't allowed to take time off. They even forced me to sign a sheet stating I wouldn't have any personal time off and later doctored the paper in an obvious attempt. I ended up breaking. I couldn't take hearing others sitting there bad-mouthing disabled people and welfare people after being told I was a liberal and that wanted everything for free and I need to earn my chair. Then I knew what I was in for. So I made more formal complaints. They kept writing me up and doing things to set me up, like tell me what to do, then write me up for doing exactly what they told me to. My co-workers could take our lunches and sit and talk politics while I had to do the work and listening to them insult me and the people I knew that had been in need, such as my mom. We had food stamps growing up. It hurt me deeply once I knew they were talking about me all along. I filed a discrimination complaint and they fired me. I have been waiting for over five months for an unemployment hearing simply because Carr denies I was ever disabled and even claims all my doctor's appointments were me leaving for car trouble. Of course, the state gives them the benefit of the doubt against all my written documentation. Thus, I have to starve because I couldn't handle being mentally and physically tortured anymore. I am about to lose my home now. I have been waiting and did what I had to do. Unemployment didn't care and Carr is laughing their way to the bank. They called me right after I filed to let me know that they knew I filed a complaint and they were going to deny my unemployment because of it. I can't eat anymore due to stress and funds. My body is shutting down. They have ripped a hole in me like I've never thought could happen. I need some sort of victory from these sick, evil, twisted bully fuckers. I am doing all I can to take care of things on my end, but I need help. I need help with my... Uh, bullies. I can't take it anymore. I don't have the strength. Well, uh, again, I don't know Rich personally, uh, but seemingly he has documentation, and my opinion of him, obviously uh, he's stayed connected on Facebook. If I didn't like him and didn't think he was worthy, he wouldn't be there. Um, he needs some help from us. And I do know how these corporations are. And when we're talking politics, um, if you're of a different political opinion than the company you work for, well, we know that that never works out very well either. And then you couple that with the fact that he started the job and they knew he was disabled and they manipulated that for their own pleasure. Well, I'm pretty fucking disgusted. I'm going to ask anybody that sees this video to re-upload it, share it on your Twitter, your Facebook, 
boycott car arms you can see what I'm about to post over here on their Facebook page which I'll link you to as well and no I'm not going to like it uh, actually no I will you know why I will because then I can continually tag them in my posts so maybe you'll like them as well for the fact that you can tag them when you put this video on your Facebook and then they can know that we the people human beings from the planet Earth are standing up with and for our brother Rich Fu. Now I'm going to read you what I put on their Facebook and I'm about to post that now. I would like to know why you have treated a disabled person so poorly and why you will go out of your way to ensure Rich Fu is not allowed unemployment benefits. My knowledge of the situation leads me to believe that myself and my extensive social networks should boycott your products. Maybe Rich would like to join me on my live talk program. I'm going to ask Rich if he will join me on Thursday night for the Voice of the Humanity so that we can uh, get down even more to the nitty-gritty and bring more attention to this. But in the meantime, let's post that on their wall. That'll signal Rich, and I'm going to like it even. Uh, that'll signal Rich that um, we're taking some kind of action to support him. So, uh, people, please re-upload this, share this on your social networks. Come over here. The link to Car Arms on Facebook and their website will be below in the description box. And as always, much love and many thanks for your support.